guys, I am Lindsay. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Inside the Hem, where we are sewing the Seamwork Fallon Jogger Pants together. It's a real quick one, but I do have a lot of fun tips and tricks in here um, for you as well. So yeah, let's get to it. <laughs> Grab one, back. Grab one, front. Where right sides together, the side seams match. Okay, so we've got our crotches on one side and our side seams on the other. And pin your side seams together. So you're gonna go sew these and also um, uh, finish them. They say press the seam allowances open and then finish. Depending on your fabric, if you're going to have your seams pressed open like a book and finish on a serger, I like to go ahead and serge them now. It's just easier to do. I'm going to just serge mine together because my fabric is lightweight enough. If your fabric is thicker, um, like a corduroy or something, you might want to go ahead and serge now so that you can press them open and have less bulk in your side seams. All right, so let's attach this cargo pocket. We've got to prep it first, and then we're going to actually attach it over. It's going to go over the side seam. So um, if you did not press your seams open um, and you did it like me, where you surge and you press to one side, make sure you press to the back. Um, okay, so cargo pocket. Let's do it. Okay, pattern piece H. So we're gonna do a very similar thing that we did for the back pocket. Um, with this upper edge that has a little notch on it, we are gonna turn it to the wrong side by quarter of an inch and then the right side by one inch. That's the exact same thing actually that we did for the back pocket. So go ahead and do that. Um, and then we're gonna secure both uh, side seams at the five eighths, whereas the back pocket, we just did the one. Remember, we're going to do two of them, both sides. After you address the top end of the pocket, you're going to go to the iron and turn all the raw edges in by five eighths, just like we did on the back pocket. Same exact thing. Now we're going to attach this to the seam allowance of the wearer's right leg. So when you're looking at it, it's opposite. So when we're looking at it, it looks like the left. That means when we wear it, we wear it on the right, okay? So that's gonna be where this goes. We are going to place it where the notches are lined up with the side seam and the dots match with the dots on the pants and she is going to get sewn around all three of these edges, all the ones except for the top one that you did. For what it's worth, it might be worth it to grab a tailor's ham or just like a rolled up towel or something and kind of like mimic the curve of the body. That way when you go, I mean, of course your leg is not. <laughs> small but when you go to wear this so that it won't pucker or pull you just it's not going to be perfectly flat like if you were to just lay it on your table like this and pin it perfectly flat you might get some pulling and some weird stuff you kind of actually really want it similar to how we did with this pocket up here you want it to have a little bit of ease in it so that it can wrap around the side of your leg not super dramatic nothing crazy um, but definitely not perfectly flat either okay Okay, so that part is attached. Now you're going to take the upper part of the cargo pocket, which is I, and you are going to take, you cut two of them, so you're going to take both of those and you are going to sew um, around all three edges except for one little gap right here, somewhere around the center of one of the long edges. So just go all the way around those. You are going to clip your corners 
turn it right side out, press it super well, and then we'll attach it to the pants. So you've got your little flap sewn, um, turned, trimmed, turned, pressed. You can spend a lot of time on these corners and make this look like the perfect little square because essentially we are just gonna place this on top and top stitch over. So nothing is gonna be hidden. Like all of your, if it's looking funky like that, that's gonna show. Um, a little less obvious if I do it that side up. Either way, so we are going to edge stitch around the bottom three. So decide, you know, how, how you want this to be oriented. Um, and so the bottom three, and then we're gonna top stitch this onto the pants along the top edge. Well, that couldn't be cuter, right? Cute little cargo pocket, you know, whatever. All right, like I said, a really quick one for you guys today. Um, great opportunity for you all to also catch up on any of the lessons prior.